Hi, this is Kushbu with another theorem of Euclid's geometry. This is theorem number 5.1 from NCRT page number 85. This says two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. Now we prove that like two distinct lines, two different lines, they can be a common point. Ho sakta. Chai lines are like this, chai is like this, chai is like this, but common points are like this. You have to prove that. So, you have to give two lines. Supposingly P and Q. And to prove Kernel, they have only one common point. In which the common points are A key. Proof. We let the two lines, two points, two points per, two different points per intersect Kernel. Let Lines P and Q intersect at two distinct points L and M. We have two points per intersect. Kar rahe. So, this means that we have two points per intersect. Kar rahe hai. So, basically, we have two different points, hai. two distinct points. Hai. So, these lines are passing through two distinct points. So these lines are passing through two distinct points. So I think exam for that only one point that the two distinct points can have only one and only one point in common. So, if you are talking about a line, it has one key. Two distinct points, if you are talking about a line, it has one key point, one key point can be used. So, our assumption contradicts the axiom that there is one and only one One and only one unique line, unique line passing through two distinct points, passing through two distinct points. So that means our assumption is wrong. So our assumption was wrong. Our assumption was wrong. Hence, two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. Two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. So this was theorem number 5.1 from NCRT and do watch the next video for some more questions. Goodbye.